Hello and welcome back. Um, as you can see, today we're shooting freehand. Um, the reason is uh, the CNC is uh, on the work table today. I've done a lot of work getting the uh, end stops mounted. Um, they're here. And the other one is back here. I'll show some photos of it. Uh, I've got the wiring the way I want it and uh, it looks like everything is working now um, to the extent uh, that the software is permitting it I need to do some changes in the firmware for the Arduino but apart from that everything looks very nice I've done a few experiments on the tool holder um, as you can see right here this now slides off. Uh, it's a perfect fit. Take this off. Um, this actually slides on and fits absolutely perfectly. It can then be fastened down with the two screws here. Uh, this here is only for keeping it from sliding away and this one will fix it down. I haven't been able to get a, uh, a complete uh, tool head together uh, mostly due to uh, not having the time. Um, the motors are the new ones from Long's. Um, I'm really happy with those. They're so quiet. On this side here we have uh, the bearings um, holding the belt in place. Uh, these are just uh, two regular uh, five millimeter inner diameter bearings and a tiny piece of threaded rod. Uh, it's simple enough uh, and it works really well. So let's have a look. I'm going to put it in motion. I hope that it, that it works. I had, uh, I had a big problem um, with the solder connections here. Um, these, uh, these female connectors here I don't know, solder just <laughs> doesn't seem to want to stick down on it. So let's see if we can get it to move. Right now in this setup, uh, this is close to the maximum speed that I'm getting with uh, 1 16th of a step. Um, if I wanted to go faster, I will have to uh, decrease the number of steps um, through, the, uh, through the stepper controllers but everything looks very nice, very neat um, it's really quiet uh, which is something that I was going for and it is also very fast at the beginning I had some problems uh, with, uh, with losing steps, but it turned out that it was the firmware um, because I was using a broken version of my own firmware. Um, it's kind of embarrassing, but yeah, shit happens. So for now, uh, this is it. I will be getting to work on the tool holders. Um, I bought a uh, 1000 milliwatt laser and I want to see if I can do extrusion milling on a uh, paint coated PCB uh, that would be great that would be really great if that works because it could uh, make things really simple and uh, I will try to uh, get a z-axis construction working um, with a stepper on it um, those are the next steps. So for today, uh, for today, that's it. Um, have a good weekend, and thanks for watching. Bye bye.